Imagine soaring through the sky in your own car, bypassing traffic and reaching your destination in record time. Does that sound like a fantasy? Well, it might not be for long. We are on the brink of a transportation revolution where our very own cars might take to the skies. The buzz around flying cars is growing, promising a future with less traffic and speedy commutes. Just picture it, a world where rush hour is a thing of the past. With advancement in technology the fantasy of flying cars could become a reality sooner than we think. You might be wondering are flying cars even feasible? Let's dive into some real-world examples and prototypes that are currently in development. First off let's talk about the Terrafugia Transition. It's a trailblazing prototype that's been in the works for over a decade and it's making some serious headway. The Transition is a hybrid vehicle, part car, part airplane, designed to shift seamlessly between the road and the sky. It's got foldable wings, a propeller, and is designed to fit into a standard garage. Pretty nifty, right? Now let's shift gears and take a look at Uber's Elevate. Uber, the powerhouse in ride-sharing, is aiming to take their services to the skies. The Elevate is a vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, or VTL for short. It's designed to soar above traffic congestion, turning your two-hour commute into a breezy 20-minute flight. Uber has some lofty ambitions aiming to launch their air taxi service in the next few years. And then there's Airbus, a titan in the aviation industry, and their Vahana prototype. The Vahana is also a VT all, but it's autonomous. That's right, a self-flying car. It's got eight propellers, a sleek design, and has already completed successful test flights. Airbus is hoping to revolutionize urban mobility, making the morning commute a breeze. These are just three examples of the many prototypes in development. Each has its own unique features, from the transition's hybrid design, to the Elevate's ride-sharing potential, and the Vahana's autonomous capabilities. They're all pushing the boundaries of what's possible, turning science fiction into reality. It's important to remember that we're still in the early stages of development. There are significant hurdles to overcome, from regulatory challenges to infrastructure needs and safety concerns. But the progress made so far is promising. These prototypes are taking to the skies, proving that the concept of a flying car is more than just a fanciful notion. These prototypes demonstrate that the concept of flying cars isn't just a pipe dream, but a tangible possibility. While the idea of flying cars is exciting, it's not without its challenges. As we move towards this revolutionary shift in transportation, a few formidable obstacles need to be navigated. Firstly, safety is a paramount concern. Flying cars are essentially mini airplanes, they'll be zipping around in the skies over our homes, schools and workplaces, there's no room for error. Manufacturers will have to ensure the highest level of safety standards, far exceeding those of ground vehicles. This includes collision avoidance systems, fail-safe mechanisms, and emergency landing options. Do you remember the game Flappy Bird? Well we don't want our skies to turn into a real-life version of that, do we? Next up, we have regulatory issues. The current laws and regulations governing our roads and airspace are not designed for flying cars. We need new rules and standards, a whole new traffic control system, and a way to manage the likely increase in air traffic. It's like creating an entirely new version of the highway code, but for the sky. Then we have the infrastructural requirements. We can't just park our flying cars on the street or in our backyards. We'll need launch pads, landing zones, and servicing stations. And these will have to be strategically located, easily accessible, and built to accommodate a variety of vehicle designs. It'll be a bit like building a network of mini airports. Last but not least, we must consider the environmental impact. While some flying cars may be electric, others may rely on fossil fuels. The increased energy consumption and potential emissions could have significant environmental consequences. It's essential that the development of flying cars aligns with sustainability goals. We don't want to solve one problem by creating another, right? Overcoming these challenges will require innovation, cooperation, and a clear vision for the future of transportation. Navigating these obstacles won't be easy, but with the right approach, we can ensure that the sky's not the limit for the future of transportation. So what could the world look like with flying cars? Well, let's take a moment to consider how the potential advent of flying cars could revolutionize our daily lives, cities, and society at large. Imagine the morning hustle and bustle, but instead of being stuck in a traffic jam on the ground, you're soaring through the sky with a bird's eye view of the city beneath you. That's what commuting could look like in a world with flying cars. Not only could this drastically reduce travel times, but it could also completely transform our perception of distance. A journey that currently takes an hour on congested roads could be reduced to mere minutes. Our world could become smaller, more connected, 
Living in the countryside and working in the city might no longer be a logistical nightmare but a feasible, even desirable option. Now think about our cities. Urban planning as we know it could be turned on its head. Our current infrastructure is designed around roads and ground transportation. With flying cars we would need to think vertically. There would be a need for takeoff and landing zones, possibly on rooftops or specially designed platforms. Buildings and structures might need to be redesigned to accommodate this new form of transportation. And let's not forget about the environmental impact. While it's true that flying cars could potentially contribute to noise and air pollution, advancements in technology could lead to cleaner, quieter flying cars. Imagine a fleet of electric flying taxis whizzing about, causing less pollution than their ground-based counterparts. But it's not just about practical implications. The psychological impact could be significant too. The freedom to fly could give us a sense of liberation, a feeling of breaking free from the constraints of ground-based travel. In the grand scheme of things, the potential impact of flying cars extends far beyond mere convenience. This technology has the potential to redefine how we live, how our cities are designed, and even how we perceive the world around us. The impact of flying cars could be transformative, reshaping our cities and our lives in ways we can only begin to imagine. From a dream to reality, the journey of flying cars is filled with anticipation and challenges. We've taken a deep dive into this fascinating topic, exploring the realm of possibilities that once existed only in science fiction. We've seen the feasibility of flying cars, how they're no longer just the stuff of dreams or movie magic. Developers and innovators worldwide are racing to turn this dream into a reality, with prototypes already in the testing phase. We've also touched on the challenges that lie ahead. From regulatory hurdles to safety concerns and infrastructure needs, there's a lot on the road, or should I say in the sky, to making flying cars a reality. But with every challenge comes an opportunity for innovation and growth. And let's not forget the potential impact of this technology. Imagine a world where traffic jams are a thing of the past, where commutes are drastically shortened, and where transportation is revolutionized in a way that we've never seen before. The potential benefits are immense and could truly transform our daily lives. As we stand on the brink of this exciting new era in transportation, one thing is certain, the sky is no longer the limit. If you've enjoyed this journey into the future, please subscribing and hitting that like button. Share your thoughts on flying cars in the comments below. Until next time, thanks for watching.